like cherries. Pumpkin pie is still my favorite, though. Like, if we're gonna talk about fruit pies, pumpkin pie would definitely be my favorite. And yes, I know, pumpkin isn't a fruit, but you know what I mean. I'm well aware pumpkin is not a fruit. Oh, you kids just look great. But I mean, no one's gonna eat a vegetable pie, which is what it is. Reminds me, I've got some acorn squash on the counter to cook for dinner later this week. Delicious acorn squash. Carrot cake. Carrot cake is good too, but carrot cake is a hit or miss cake for me. Sometimes you make it too sweet. I love veggie pie, aka pizza. Heck yes. What is rhubarb? Rhubarb is... <laughs> rhubarb, you need a special license to farm. This is actually very poisonous. I think rhubarb is considered a vegetable. I'd actually have to look. But I think rhubarb is a vegetable. Yeah. I am Lady Liberty. I didn't change costumes. Or is Everett Lady? No, I think Everett is Lady Liberty. That's hilarious. Boom. Basic attack. Ah! What? Oh, okay. Okay, okay. Don't heal him! Rude. Ow. <laughs> she blocks with her book. Mmm, forbidden pie. See, now I want a pot pie. What? <laughs> what was that? What was that? That was ridiculous. Oh my god, that was ridiculous. That attack was funny as heck. Ah, no, I have to move. Oh my god, that anthem attack is priceless. Nice, we leveled up. Imagine the recording lines from Liberty Prime and Fallout. I have never played Fallout. Uh, I want you to be... And actually, no. Lady Liberty is pretty awesome. Eat freedom, punk. I agree. Only reason I want the robot is because of the skates. Oh man, this game is good. You know that pumpkin pie filling in cans might not actually be pumpkin? Do tell, Amaryllis, do tell. I mean, I am very specific about what pumpkin pie filling I buy, so I know it's 100% pumpkin. At least I think it is. Fire breath, fire breath. Hey, why aren't you dying from my fire breath? Because you're silly. Oh, speaking of, we saw the most adorable kids last night in dinosaur and dragon costumes. Ugh. Jeremy made from other winter squashes. I mean, the thing is, if you put enough pumpkin pie spice in it, you'd never notice it was a different uh, squash. You know, I, I am a kind of snob when it comes to that. I always buy the Libby's pumpkin pie filling. The stuff that states on the can that is 100% pumpkin pie, or 100% uh, pumpkin. But I'm a bit of a snob when it comes to stuff like that. I should do that. I haven't made pumpkin whip in a long time. It's basically just pumpkin pie filling with uh, Cool Whip and cream cheese. It's really good. 
You can dip like ginger cookies or graham crackers in it. Oh, these are actually in North American. Yeah, they are. They are. Made from real pumpkin pie. Yeah, exactly, Fletcher K. Exactly. Uh, let, let's look at this ridiculous attack again, because this is just priceless. <laughs> that attack is stupid, and I love it. That is so dumb, and I love it. Ooh, I got some uh, duplicates now. We got Swedish noses and creepy treats. We need to find that kid to trade the card with. That Billy has a decent heal. It does. It does. Oh, hello. Possible. I'm going to pass the card so you have to open the guy. Let's hope this one. Looks like you don't have it yet. Awesome. Sweet. All right. So we got one card traded. I don't know if I actually had to do that there. Yep. What's down here? Why is there a child just hiding in the sewers? Oh, I bet you this is our last hidden kid. You can't see me. I'm a ghost. Cheater. Well, at least I was the last one. Here's your prize. My parents got it for free when they gave money to public radio. Holds way more candy than my old paper. Ooh, a bigger bag. Nice. Coat bag. Oh my god. We now have a tote bag for all of our candies. There. Uh, all right. Where is the other kid that wanted a card? Because there was another kid that wanted to trade a card, but we got to find him. The most American picture ever need to take that. Oh my lord. I bet you that's funny. This is my own house. So definitely not in a hurry to go back home. Okay. I'm doing fine on cash. So where is that kid I need to give a card to? Where is Das Child for card? Uh oh. This is where that monster took my lesser half. Okay, you stay here and keep watch. I'll go get our parents. No. No way. If my parents found out I let monsters kidnap my brother, even though I'm the favorite, they're going to care a little, you know? Oh, they probably won't even believe us. I guess this is one door I have to go through alone. You coming? Totally. Did I get all the candy? Trick or treat gate. Beat it, Grubbins. You know this gate won't open until every house has been liberated of its candy. The monsters are never going to get away with this. Hey, who is this? Uh, is this is this is Gus from section 5. Gus, quit messing around and call your wife. She's worried sick about you. Yeah. Alright, so we still got houses to trick or treat, apparently. So, let's go find the houses and maybe we'll find that kid to give the card to. Awesome, Fletcher. I will check that out because I, I bet you it's hilarious. I can only imagine what the most American picture ever would be. We have a house counter somewhere. I don't know, Sergeant? I don't know. Oh, 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 
Oh, there we go. There we go. Trick or treat. We got three houses left. Three houses. How do you... Okay, so we have to do stuff. We have to do stuff. And apparently we have more bobbing for apples to do. Which, where was the apple guy? That's to learn more about good hygiene. Well, you come to the right place. Let's get bobbing. All right, concentrating while I do this. Oh no, not the core. Nice. Whoa, I think you just kept the doctor's way for a whole year. But what did we win this time? More candy. Okay. Makes no sense, but I like you. All right, so I guess we gotta do this a third time. We got to get 30 this time. Dang it. No, I've actually gone bobbing for apples. It's really not fun. Like, I don't know who came up with the idea of bobbing for apples, but it's really not a fun pastime. Oh, hush, I'm fine. That's a lot of candy snuggles. A catch. Bet it's a toothbrush. You got the Sweet Tooth Creepy Treat card. Nice! Actually, it's pretty cool. The surprise I got. And the last one. Play again, but from now on, just be recording your high score for posterity. Meh. Personal stats are the greatest for all. Yeah, that, that's a lot of candy, Snuggles. That is a lot of candy. I am sure that is going to be parceled out. Although, yeah, you'd have to. You'd have to. I'd stick it in the freezer, to be honest. But that much candy, you freeze some of it and just hang on to it for later. Oh, yeah. Yeah, knowing knowing that family surrogate, it definitely will be eaten in moderation, which is the way it should be. I actually would not be surprised if uh, Captain Snuggles' little one would self-regulate their candy use. <laughs> I know nothing. <laughs> no, no, I, I, know, I know Captain Snuggles in real life, and knowing their, uh, their child... More than likely, there will be self-regulation going on, because Captain Snuggles is a very, very good kid. All of our friends, actually, that have kids have really good kids, and every single one of them is too smart for their own good. <laughs> no joke. All of our friends' kids are way too smart for their own good, which is both amazing and terrifying. Like, no joke. If all of our friends' kids got together, they probably could take over the world. I read the math experiment where she was still at least. Statistical sample tonight. Get rough estimate of a piece of candy per pound. Just figure out how much we have to actually eat every day. If this is going to be stressful Thanksgiving, Christmas, and New Year's. Heck yes. Heck yes. And knowing your kid, they'll love every second of figuring all that math out. That's awesome. Oh, figure out how many pieces of candy per pound. On average, because obviously it's not going to be perfect because some pieces of candy are heavier than others. Oh, that's fantastic. We do, and then we will ask, so this is too much candy. Yeah, exactly. Is this too much candy? It is too much candy. Seven pounds is impressive, but I mean, it also depends on what you got. Because, like, seven pounds of gummy worms is not the same thing as, like, seven pounds of, um, popcorn balls. 
Which reminds me, next year I need to bring a teal pumpkin with us when we go to our friend's house. Just to make sure that people know that we also have uh, sugar-free and gluten-free treats with us. Because yes, I am the teal pumpkin person. I know way too many people that uh, have needs for low sugar and gluten-free and dairy-free stuff. And I think the Teal Pumpkin Project is amazing. Yeah, you know, you got the odd full-size sticker. Yeah, exactly. Seven pounds of nothing but peach rings. That is way too many peach rings, and that's a lot of peach rings. That's like the one time we went to the Albanese factory and bought 30 pounds of gummies. Think about how many gummies that is to buy 30 pounds of gummies. Seven pounds of bit of honey. You know, I like bit of honeys in very small amounts. Like, bit of honeys are tasty, but like, one or two of those is plenty. Uh, trunkful, uh-huh. Oh, I know you have, Snuggles. I know you have. Anybody that's been to Gen Con from our area knows what it's like to buy 30 pounds of gummies from Albanese. I miss that. That's kind of sad that that's the thing I miss most about Gen Con, besides hanging out with people, is getting the Albanese gummies. Oh, so many gummies. Yeah, you should, surrogate. You should. Alright, I need to find these three houses and the kit that we need to give the card to. Like, am I just blanking out? Oh, there's more candies now. Uh, how about I just buy everything? Is that seven... Oh, I can't buy everything. Okay. Um... Don't need that. Slime effect applies splash damage to nearby enemies, crit strike damage, counterattack on successful defend. Grab that one, that one. That one and that one. Actually, I probably should assign those now. Oh, uh, let's see. Ren, you're going to get... Currently got the higher attack power. We'll leave you with that one. Give you the defend power. Yeah, more health is nice, but out of the choices, I like that one the least. Alright, where is this kid... That wants the card, and where are these last couple of houses? Where are these last three houses I need to find? Or I trick or treated that one. Oh, there's the kid. Yes, I'm going to take my extra Choco Nana for it. Yeah, buddy. All right, now we need to find the three houses. What we got left here. All right, go after Reynold. We got three more houses. Find out about the creepy witch that stole my costume. Where are these houses? A mip. A mip would be nice. Tell me what houses I'm missing. Where are these houses, and how do I get out of here? There's a ramp. Where are these houses I need to go frequent? Alright, we trick-or-treated that one. We did that one. We did that one. We did that one. Did that one. That's a save point. 
Uh, that, not that one. That one looks like we haven't done it yet, so there's one. And what is that, surrogate? He says, as much as you can eat or I'll eat all myself. Okay. Andy! I like the fact that the, uh, the bag has changed to a tote bag, too. It is good attention to detail to actually change my candy acquisition bag. Alright, we did that house. There isn't a house down here. And up there. Yeah, I've seen it, surrogate. I wish I could unsee it. The, the nerf dart guy is actually kind of terrifying. He's like a nerf yeti and I'm not a fan. Not a fan of the nerf yeti, to be honest. All right, so where are these last three houses? Two houses now. Oh, thank God I don't have normal TV. I do not have normal TV, so I do not have to suffer the pain of those commercials. Where are these houses? Can I, can I trick or treat the patriotic house? No. How did I miss three houses? Yeah, see, we don't even get any normal channels. Like, our TV can't even pick them up because we're in an area that's kind of a horrible dead zone. We had a TV antenna. It didn't do anything. And I'm not putting a tower up behind our house, which would be the only way to get channels, because even then we'd only get one or two, and why bother? We don't watch a lot of TV as it is. Where are these two houses? Come on, throw me a bone here, game. Where are my houses? Where are my houses? Looking for porch lights, and I don't see any. Where did I miss the houses? I did that one. Did that one. Yeah, no, the nearest station to us is quite a bit of ways. Three houses don't count as houses, probably. I didn't even see a tree house that we could go up to and trick or treat. I see a ladder by the sewer. Yeah, that's to go down into the sewer. That's a street light. I mean, obviously, I missed a couple of houses somewhere. I just am too numb to realize where. There's the gate. Trick or treat at that house. Oh, yeah, none of the cable channels are the way they used to be. They've all pretty much sold out at this point. I remember when the History Channel used to show history shows. Now it's all Bigfoot and Ghost Hunters. Okay, it's got to be over here. Wherever this house is, it has to be over here. Yeah, MTV was music and music videos. Uh, you're not wrong, Snuggles. You are not wrong, and I really don't like those shows. I mean, you wonder why you have issues with the ghost doing nasty things to you. How would you like it if someone came into your house and just started yelling at you for no reason? Yeah, exactly. And I know exactly who you're talking about, Snuggles, too. Oh, how the mighty have fallen, because the dude that did that show is now uh, hosting the Halloween cooking shows on the cooking channel.
Spencer Brannigan is like a guest host on the uh, cooking channels now. Alright, am I just stupid and I'm not seeing these houses? That's the patriotic house. What am I missing? Okay. No, I did not think of anything else I need while I'm out. Those dinners already figured out, so. Sorry, Zero Off is running to the post office and wanted to know if I needed anything. My kingdom for a map. No, not ordering zero dash. He's just running to the post office. But no, I'm on my own for dinner tonight, which is fine by me. Actually, I have no idea what I'm going to do tonight, because my evening plans unfortunately have fallen through. Through the fault of no one. I do not have evening plans anymore. So I'm probably just going to curl up on the couch and play some Pokemon and take a break from WoW unless I decide to do real raiding in WoW. Pitch. Oh, buddy, that's terrifying. I finally got my, on retail WoW, I got my item level up to 268. So I, I guess I'm ready for actually going to a real raid now, which is kind of terrifying. I worked my butt off the last couple of weeks to get that, and oh boy. Oh yeah, Scooby-Doo in the Ghoul School was great, as was the, the one where he was a racer. Okay, how am I so dumb that I can't find where I need to go? Where are these last two houses? Where are the last two houses, chat? Why? Why am I so dumb that I can't find houses to trick or treat at? I feel like the kid that's trick or treating at like 6.45 and trick or treating ends at 7. I mean, I'm missing houses somewhere, but where? Because it's not on this side of the street. Because that one's not lit up. There is no more house over here. Done that house. Done that house. It's got to be a side alley or something that I'm missing. And I am just too numb to figure this out. Not that house. Maybe is there a way up the path that we are trying? That's what I'm thinking, Surrogate, but I mean, I'm off the path as far as I can go in some of these places. I mean, unless they're way, way back by the beginning, maybe. This is a metaphorical house. No, it's a real house. There, There is a door that I must knock upon to receive my sugary goods. There is definitely a house to receive sugary goods from. All right, that's the graveyard house. I think the metaphor beauty itself. No, I wish it was that easy. Done this one. Leave it to me to get lost in a game. This is why it takes me so long to beat video games sometimes is that I just get lost. Wait. That house is lit up. 
I just completely miss one side of the street? Apparently, yes. Yes, I did. Hey, welcome, buddy. And Wild Wolf, welcome in. Welcome in. How are you doing today? Take your last kid, so just take it all. Nice. Oh, no. I get lost in games all the time, surrogate. So, process of elimination would say I probably missed... Nope. Dang it, I was hoping that'd be an easy score and getting two houses in a row. Um, maybe? No, this house has already been done too. What's up, surrogate? I'm waiting, I'm waiting. So I'm sure y'all see something that I don't. Northwest. The one behind this one. All right, how do you get there? You're right. There is one up there. Bingo! Good eyes. Good eyes. Rubbin! No! All right, that's all 20 houses. That one was a bit hidden, but we got it. I'll house the of candy. I'll grab his report path to HQ for immediate evac. Sweet! Let's go! Yeah! These tombstones aren't styrofoam? Eh. I think it was just well hidden. Uh oh, these monsters are just waiting for us. I bet if we could sneak up behind one, we can give a good whack with my candy pail. Let's fight. <laughs> I love that. You just walk up behind him and hit him in the head. Get the crap out of a kid last time as I threw the door open while I was distracted. Look at this guy. We ready to float up and up. Oh, that's awesome, Snuggles. That's awesome. Yeah, I just wore my big costume while we handed out candy to kids and had quite a bit of fun with it, too. We had quite a bit of fun last night. Definitely made some kids very happy and some very, very confused. Counterattack! Boom. No more healing. No heals for you. Ow. I never did ask. Hopefully the volume is good for y'all out there. Yes. Aw, oh, well, that's a shame, surrogate, but I mean, if you need your rest, you need your rest. Whap. Quite low compared to you, but I can hear it. Okay, well, I could turn it up. Alright, I will turn it up then. I'm always worried about the music being too loud. I tend to err too much on the side of the music being too quiet. Hopefully I didn't just break the game. There. It has been adjusted slightly. How long this game is. Ah, gotcha. I like we're not going to fight you anyway. Ba -ba -da -ba -bum, ba -ba -da -ba -ba -da -bum. Beating down people with my torch of liberty. Wap. Wap. Missed. That's some violence, so I have your damage in. Yeah, that's true. That's true, Snuggles. 
But if more than one person says the volume is low, I will adjust it. I kind of take the consensus of everybody. Because I also realize that I have very sensitive hearing. So what I think is loud is not really loud to most people. I love this attack so much. This is so ridiculous and I just adore it. Well, yeah, yeah, the constant migraines don't help, Surrogate. And I'm glad that you're uh, hopefully going to get an answer to that soon, I hope. I really hope you get an answer to that when you go in to get checked out. Nope, too soon. Yeah. Oh, wrong button. Long battle here, so I keep missing buttons. Box cake? I hope so. I hope so, Kagan. Even though why I'm bothering to get more candy. I have so much. Ah, welcome on in, Zoan. Welcome in, welcome in. How are you doing, gamer Zoan? If you're having a good one, we're getting some belated trick-or-treating done today. This means my seeing. Well, then that's fair. That's fair, surrogate. I, uh, Zero Wolf and I still haven't figured out what we're doing for Thanksgiving this year. Because we're either doing a Friendsgiving or we're... What? Hi? Hey, you talking scarecrow. Aren't you afraid? Not really. Should be. We're chasing a very powerful, very dangerous witch. Can you help us fight her? No. But I can give you this. Pumpkin costume pattern. Nice! A little something to help you get started. Okay. Those are mummies. What's that? Ah, jokes with me. I actually hear both highly sensitive and selective. Nice, bunny fist. Fighting off sickness. Oof, not fun. I hope you feel better soon, though. Oh, maybe hit it? Alright, so we gotta hit something. Hey, I don't know what uh, Zero Wolf and I are doing for Thanksgiving this year. We have the choice between doing a Friendsgiving, which is my preferred thing. Uh, or we go to families. Interesting. All right, so we can't whack those open. I know we're behind schedule, Drusilla. It's just these grubbins are so lazy. Especially that one. I caught him sleeping under the bus. Just get all this candy loaded in the next five minutes, Bojan. Take it to the Autumn Haven Mall. Max Tell is there, and he says he's found the candy mother load. Don't be late, or I'll take the staff and make you even more ugly than you are right now. Oh. That was not so personal. Okay, listen up, Bojo. You can have all the candy you want. We won't stop you. We just want that really big piece over there. Are you nuts? That's our prize piece. The boss is going to really love eating that one. It looks super chewy. What? Ren, if they eat me, I'm totally telling. No one's eating anything except the middle management weasel is about to eat his megaphone. Normally, I'd like to think of myself as a conscientious builder, but my job is on the line here, so I think I'm just going to have to show you my mean side. Boss fight! We 
do all the fights. Yeah, I only skipped one. Oh, what? Ah. Uh... Oh, okay. Well, I'm going to guess because it's a separate thing, we probably should attack the megaphone. Of course, I accidentally attacked the wrong thing. But yeah, we're going to go after that megaphone. Mandatory steam team building exercise. Yeah, we want to get rid of that megaphone. That megaphone needs to go bye-bye immediately. And I attacked the wrong thing again. Uh, yeah, I know. I know it does, Surrogate. I just keep hitting the wrong thing. Oh. All right, missile barrage on the megaphone. Yeah, stop doing that. We'll do an anthem because that gives us leech. Stop healing him. Come on, megaphone. Jerk dodged. All right, megaphone is almost down. That stupid shaman would stop healing it. All right, Megaphone has done. Now let's get rid of that Shaman. Bomb button. It would really help if I could hit the right dang button sometimes. Um, yeah. We'll do Anthem again. That's gonna make me giggle every time. Alright, the Shaman is down. Ren is also down, which is a problem. Hope I can do this. I have more. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, surrogate. Got new items. Awesome! Oh, I have to pick today to quit smoking. All right, let's just get on that bus, and the bus is gone. After that bus! Evil Fall is a name on the license plate. Oh boy. Oh, we're on level two now. Ow. Ow, I landed on my dice. Quick, let's get inside before they see us in the rear room here. How are we gonna get home after all this? Oh no. Where are we? Autumn Haven Mall, I think. This is a mall. It looks more like a dungeon, which I am totally prepared for. Part of the mall must still be under construction. Hey, look, a dungeon map. Hey, come check this out. What do you see? Mother Load Candy Emporium? Bingo. And that's where they're headed. And quick, to the candy store. All right, well, we got some stuff to whack. I really don't know why I'm collecting all the candy. 
I'm gonna go with that super dark and spooky hallway, but my instincts say not without a bright light. Uh, my instinct is to follow your instincts on this one. You know, I just realized too, I wonder if we missed getting the pumpkin costume. Multiple neighborhoods. Oh! Huh. Alright, so I guess we didn't miss getting the pumpkin costume. There should be falling from above. Need some head protection. Okay. Oh, no worries, surrogate. You take care and I hope your head feels better. I am just going to wander to Derelict Mall and see what we can find. Reminds me when I used to go behind the scenes at Woodfield. Hey look, it's the candy store. It has chalk full of monsters. Careful kids, you don't want to go near that place tonight. It's been taken over by teenagers. Shudder. Sir, those are monsters. They sure are, especially between the ages of 14 and 20. Wow. I was going to check out the mall costume party after my shift. But not with those scruffy hooligans running loose. Guess I bought this nifty space warrior costume pattern for nothing. Ooh, can we have it? Sure, but take my advice. Stay on the dark side of the mall where it's safe. Sweet, new costume. Oh. All right, well, ready to call your monster mommy. Nice. All right, so I guess we're the knight this time. Oh, ugh, that guy's big. I don't like him. All right, well, let's, I guess, take care of this guy first. Dodge and retaliate? Yes. Yes. Dabby stab. And Zot with the flames. Lock. Uh, no, just basic attack. You, however, can do your thing. God, I love this anthem attack. It's so funny. And then hit the wrong button, because I'm not paying attention. Whack. Is that a wacky arm fling and playable tube man in the background? I think that was a wacky arm waving inflatable tube man in the background. Hi. Trick or treat? Uh oh. I wasn't expecting trick or treats because of all the construction. I don't have any candy, but you can have these old snow boots I found when I was cleaning out my shop. Thanks. That's a costume piece. Oh, look at all the dark stuff. Come on, turn around. Trick or treat. Construction zone. Where are your safety equipment? Here, take the safety visor so you don't get hurt, okay? Thank you, sir. Safety first. Nice. Candy. Candy time. Hey, wake up. Huh? We're at the recycling committee. Have any bottles for us? Hey, knock yourself out, kid. Just keep the noise down, okay? People working over here. Nice. That should do it. We have all the items we need for the Space Warrior costume. Most excellent. That's actually really cute. 
That's actually super cute. What does that one do? Melee. Combat ability. Meteor avalanche. A giant asteroid is summoned over the combat area, damaging all enemies. Blow. Oh! Oh, that's awesome. You can use your lightsaber as a glow stick. Very nice. Not so fast. Oh, cute! That's so cute! Oh, that's not cute. That's a lot of things to fight. All right, well, let's take care of that shaman. More than likely, they're the one that's going to cause a problem. Almost took him out in one hit. Oh, retaliate! You're gonna heal because you're a jerk. No! Wrong button. But you're still dead. Or you will be. Yes, ground control to Major Tom. That is such a good, creepy song. It really is. Ooh, Everett, you're hurting, bud. No, Everett! Oh. Wow, that did like nothing. You might die. No! We died! Boo! Oh, I guess we just fight him again. Okay. All right, well, round two, electric boogaloo. I really do like all the combat in this is like comic booky. Really, you just buff the healer with a why would you buff the healer with a melee? Random? This is almost a waste. I really wish you'd stop buffing each other. Ow! Dude, ow! That hurt a little. Owie. <laughs> that will never stop being funny. Yeah, that hurts a little. That definitely hurts a little. But he's dead. Woo! Edible hat? I prefer edible underwear. I wonder what they use to make the sword light up. Just random crafty thoughts here. I wonder what they ended up using to make the sword light up. Surprise attack! Nice! Uh, it doesn't really matter which one we attack first. Whack. Yeah, Major Tom is such a good song. It's sad, though. I remember the first time that I actually realized what the lyrics were saying, and it's like, oh, this is... This is not the kind of song that I thought it was. It's actually really sad. I 
I mean, being a Bowie song, I'm not surprised. A lot of his songs are far deeper than you think they are. Crap. Now, I am going to do something different here and just kill it. There's no reason to do an anthem. He's very close to dead. Ooh, we got a cinnamon brain. Mmm, cinnamon brain gummy bears would be delicious. 